everybody. Um, hopefully this time the audio will be a lot better. I actually got a new microphone. Now for today I wanted to show you a new trick that I actually did a Jane Davenport twist uh, with my daughter uh, Victoria. She wanted to play again with a um, with a Jane Davenport inks. incredible inks. They have <coughs> such beautiful color selection. My favorite one's the fairy floss. I like that color. It's like a deep pink and I like it. All right. Well, we're going to be using that for your marbling. Yay. Now, um, I found some instructions on how to do some shaving cream marbling, but instead of using regular paints, we're going to use it. Try, we're going to try them out with the inks. Um, we'll see how it works and you guys can see how this turn out. I'm using two types of paper in here. This is a watercolor paper, which is a rougher texture. I also have a vellum paper by Bristol Strathmore, which is a more, it's a thick, but it, it's not as rough surface. So it actually pick up some of the marbling as well. Um, you're gonna need a ruler, inks, your color selection inks in this case. Um, my daughter decided to choose the Incredible Inks Blueberry, uh, the Lemon Cherber one, and the Fairy Floss because this is her favorite color. I picked for her some uh, shaving cream to do the marbling. Um, I decided to do it this way because even though I have this set by uh, Jane Davenport, which is a marbling kit, I um, wanted to do something a little bit more friendlier for her and a lot easier for her to use. So we're still gonna be using Jane Davenport products. It's just that we're gonna be using the incredible inks instead of uh, the paints in there. So that way she has a wider selection and do more as well. Well, we'll start the project with just applying the shaving cream <laughs> in here. A thick layer. It smells like baby powder for some reason. Well, the shaving cream smells really good. <laughs> it's gonna be very smells good. Okay. Now I do have like a little spatula thing that I'm gonna use so that way we can even this out. And I also have like a little needle type tool. You can use this skewer if you want. You just shape it in there. Messy. It makes a weird noise. <laughs> That's fun though. It is. I even it out as much as possible. Then here, honey, which color you want to start with? We're going to start with fairy floss. Okay. Then <laughs> you probably already guessed it. Put it to the side and start Trinkling some of that ink in here. Open. Oh. <laughs> just grab a little bit and just trickle it like that. The little particles that like they splat on it already makes a unique color. Yeah, you see what once we do this. It. All right, now after you put that color, we'll put a secondary color. If you want a secondary color, in this case, we're gonna accent it with the yellow one, which is uh, lemon sugar, it smells delicious. And then we're gonna do a third color. She wanted to use the blueberry one. Also very yummy. There's scented inks and they smell real good. <laughs> and then what we got to do is we got our tool and we can just start doing like that that makes a weird sound too everything makes a weird sound now if you have a skewer which i do have it's a little bigger it'll go differently I think we should probably do more colors too. Yes. 
I'm gonna use the mermaid, mermaid tail. tail. I got limonade here. I picked it up because it looks like a vibrant green. You want that one too? Sure. That looks like a seafoam green on it. Just put a little bit in there. Whoa! There you go. Put it back in there. We keep marbling this. Then you can go this way too. Mm -hmm. Whoa. I know, that's cool. really cool. Then you grab your piece of paper ready. Which one are we using first? Uh, I think we're going to use a watercolor paper one. Or try with a watercolor. Just put the watercolor paper on top. And then you gently tap it. And then you remove it. I want to see how it looks. Wait a minute. <laughs> Whoa! Remove it. Whoa! <laughs> well, the fun part begins. Remove the tray. Oh, okay. <laughs> Take away this. And then you just go like so. Whoa, that's so cool. And clean it up. What? It literally is magic. That's cool. <laughs> and clean it up. It looks like frosting, so. and then someone put like food coloring in the frosting. <laughs> that looks pretty cool. It looks a lot better. Now, we put this to the side so it needs to dry. And then, voila! Now, I don't... I like how this looks. Yeah, so we'll mix it. So what I'm going to do it is... It looks like a rainbow. I know it does look like a pretty rainbow, does it? Like rainbow frosting. <laughs> Go like this. Alright, hold that. Ooh, oh my god, I just got some on me. We grab, I'm going to grab one of my Jane Davenport journals. But I want to add a couple more colors to it Ooh. too. Uh, we haven't used any purple, so I'm going to just like use the same background. And just add some purples in here. Ooh, can we use fresh air too? No, that actually sounds like a nice idea. Because it looks like a really nice sky blue. And that. I really like the names. <laughs> she chooses. Yeah, they're really cute. And they're so creative. There you go. They smell so good. Alright, now my Jane Davenport small journal. I have it ready, prepare. So that way I can just go ahead and do the marbling on it. So just do like this if you want. Or we'll grab a texture one like this. And go like this. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Put that in there. Whoa, that purple's really cool. And we just put the journal down. It looks kind of messy. It does. <laughs> <laughs> and then we lift. Oh god. I know it's gonna be sticky. Ah! Oh, but it's pretty. <laughs> and it's messy, we, but it's pretty. Then we got this. We gotta clean it out. I like the magic effect it does. Like right there. Look at that. Right there, there's a blob, but when you clear it off, it doesn't look like a blob. See, it's magic. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Now you magic. have a. Clean it up. Set it to the side to dry. Look how pretty that looks. That is beautiful. You can also do it on the big journal. <laughs> the big Jane Davenport. That thing is so big. <laughs> Okay. So you got some on. What you got to do is do the same thing again. Can I add the I, colors this time? Actually, I don't even think any color. Look how pretty that looks. It looks oh, like a right. rainbow. Oh my god! Yes. Actually, you can just instead of doing anything, what you got to do is you can grab this, 
and make some designs. Yay. We're gonna do this side, the spiky side. The spiky side. Okay, go ahead. Ooh, that's weird. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, <laughs> look. It's so weird, and the sound it makes is so <laughs> weird. Well, what we gotta do is we can either clean it on the side like so, or if you wanna do... <laughs> that's cool. It, it gives it like a little texture, I guess. Mm -hmm. I think I like it. Oh, God. Actually, let's do a paper instead of the journal. Yes. To see how that's gonna come out. You just press it down. There's so many colors. It's like so vibrant. I know. I like that the inks are so rich. And there's still some white right there. And look at this. Whoa! Ooh, oh, let's God. make sure it's all, all in the page. Cause you wanted all those inks to suck up in there. You want all the prettiness. Yes. What? What's wrong? What is wrong? Look at that. Ah! <laughs> I'm guessing we're going to need some more paper. <laughs> We gotta clean it up, <laughs> remove all the excess foam, reveal our pattern. Oh my god, it looks so pretty. Look. Uh -huh. It's on! <laughs> it does look wonderful. Remove that, honey, so that way we can <laughs> clean this up. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay, just leave it there so I can put this. We're gonna put the excess in there, back in there. there. Hold it with both hands. There you go. Cause look how pretty that looks. Look I at really, that paper. Yeah, it's so cute. You can use it for die cut, cards, projects, scrapbooking, whatever you want to use it. Like. Oh my God! Look at that. If you're like in art class and you got like a creativity test, just do this. You'll get a 100. That is too <laughs> cute. Look how pretty that looks. I like this. That is beautiful. All right. Now I can try it in my journal because I really want to do it in the big one. What? That's so cool. Messy fun. <laughs> but that's okay. Oh God, I just touched this. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, honey. It's messy. Take my now. Finger. so much try to even it out so that way you can have an even coverage and there it looks like a tiny purple I like that purple background yeah it looks like a violet like a mm -hmm. really really light violet or like a really really light uh, what's that color lilac Picking five years. whoa <laughs> we got some mixing Looks like unicorn <laughs> came here and had a party. <laughs> or a unicorn go. just came here and then he, he like pooped and then he just <laughs> ran away. <laughs> All right. What color would you want to use? Mm -hmm. Should we put some orange? Yes. <laughs> I was about to say either fresh orange or green dye. Oh God, I was about to drop it. Put this in here. I like the smells because like you never know. Like you can guess some of the smells on the name, like fresh orange, but some names are really weird, like Frida and Fairy Floss, so you're not this gonna know. This is smell like sherry, this is good. Yeah. Okay. I like the hot cocoa one. You do? Yeah. I think it's a, we should use a yellow one. Mmm, smells good. Mmm. A little here, a little there. Look how pretty that looks. Oh, good. We haven't used tinsel once, I don't think. No, not yet. Or violet syrup. We used every color, but no. I like to use. Whoa! I like to use these little texture things. I keep hitting you. I'm so sorry. I'm trying to grab this. This little texture so it gives a nice pad, and let me clean it up. Yeah. It's really messy. And then I like the curls like so. Whoa! That's really cool. Mm. It's like a heat wave color. <laughs> yeah. Oh, heat wave! There you go. This one smells like shampoo. <laughs> Lots of textures. I love that. 
This tinsel one smells like shampoo. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Now I'm going to grab my journal because I do want that bright orange in here. Yeah, heat wave. We need to get heat wave in. Now, since this is not that big, I'm going to do one page oh my God. like so. Make sure that all in there. Now, for this one, mm. I'm going to lift it. What? What just happened? Get that like so. Grab some of the in here and I'm going to create the other side right in the album well <laughs> it almost fell. like closing it back what yep making like a little sandwich yeah look it it's a shaving cream sandwich <laughs> and then wrong open page. it up wrong page <laughs> It's beautiful, but it's the wrong page. Make sure that both pages. There's no air bubbles, but make sure that the ink sticks in there. Mm, there you go. So good. It like a and then we use a scraper and remove. the phone is for me. Oh my god. I like how like this page, the page on the left, it's really bright in color and then the page on the right it's like hmm I'm going to use this. I'm going to look dark. Like darker. Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> it's okay. It, it, and voila that's how we end up with a really nice sorry about that guy is <laughs> and there you go i like it it looks really neat oh god that way i can have whoa it looks like a fire <laughs> Yeah, I like it. And then you that's set it out to the side to dry. That's the sound a fire makes. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Can I put well, it on the floor? Yeah. Okay. Now, if you want to start all over again and don't want those colors anymore, you can just clean them up. Can we do that? You want to do that? Sure. Because it looks like a bowl. Like, if we keep doing it, it's going to turn black and brown. Show them the other journal. This no. one? Mm hmm Okay. This... It's beautiful. Try to remember the colors as best as I can. <laughs> it's really messy, but it's really fun. Oh God. Don't do that. That was a dumb idea. Here you go, honey. Now it's your turn. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh god, you're gonna drop Frida now. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Just keep doing it. Oh, it goes it on. Ahead. Me, 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 me. Maybe it's a bit too much. Here. All right. It in. Even it out. Ooh. It looks really smooth. Oh, God. Even it out and add the colors. Okay. Got excess. We swipe it off there because we don't have a lot on this side. Oh, she dust her phone ring. Don't mind. Don't mind it. 
No, it wasn't. All right. Alright, there's the excess. This station is a mess. Oh, we didn't use watermelon, I don't think. No, we haven't used watermelon, so if you want to use that, then go ahead. We're going to use it. I gotta smell it first. It passed as the smell test. Oh god. <laughs> That's okay. It looked like you threw up, like, bleh. There you go. What other color you want? Hmm. Let's use violet syrup, because we didn't use that one yet. Nope, we haven't used that one either. And I was smelling this, and it smelled real good. Let me help you. Yeah. You gotta spread it a little bit more. <laughs> you're so good at this, and I'm so horrible. No, you learn. You'll see. And then tinsel, because we didn't use tinsel yet. Use the tinsel. All right. We didn't use hot cocoa, but I don't think we're going to use it. Yeah. Come on. Bloop. Sure. It looks really cool. I think you need to yellow. Mm, yeah. Yellow. Need some more vibrant. Ooh, that looks really cool. There you go. Now, you can play with these. Mm -hmm. With this. Or with this. Mm, I'm going to try the skewer first. Alright, go. And then we're going to use that. I like how you can get, like, you have so much creative freedom because you can do it whatever way you want. Mm hmm. Yeah. I mean, the colors. So vibrant. Yes. You just pick the side that you like the bone. The mess, I guess. Mm, let's use this one. Eh, yeah. I don't know. Just like it. Okay. There you go. Oh, yeah. God. I just yeah. backhanded the light. Ooh, that looks really pretty. Oh, I like it. When you're done. Oh, God. Your paper. Is that how you want it to look? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I think it looks really nice. Then press down lightly. You, you press down lightly, but make sure that the soap touches the paper. You'll get a feeling, like, mm -hmm. you will feel Make it Make sure there's no it. bubbles. Air bubbles. <laughs> no bubbles allowed. You want to capture all of that ink. Capture all of its beauty. Remove it. Ooh, that looks right, really you pretty. Take that out. <laughs> Let me just remove this. Mm -hmm. We're going to clean this. Stay there. Whoa, I'm telling you, it's just like magic. Yeah, yeah, review it. Because it looks really swirly and liney, but when you remove it, it looks really pretty. I like it. I like it too, you do it pretty good. I'm going to hang it up in my wall. <laughs> my first modeling success. Beautiful. Yes. I didn't hear this. Mm. I like how the watermelon, the first it looked like a red, now it looks really pretty. Well, that was about it. It's magic. So, if, if you're interested, you can just go ahead and check it out. Um, They have a... Oh, God. That's a pretty cool technique for you to play with. and Very fun. Fun to do, and you can get a unique look in your journal. If you want it in a journal, or if you want it on a piece of paper so you can die cut it later on. All right. Thank you for staying with us, and have a good bye. 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 Yeah. Bye.